a woman that's modest versus someone that's not modest? What does that look like? Shit. Uh, pull up that last show uh, episode uh, Chanel was on. I mean, well, I don't know if there's any of them women on there, but I can tell you some of them was dressed like, okay, yeah, they look like they're down a bottle of, of Crown in the club or some shit. That type of vibe. Do y'all wear onesies on here? Anybody wear onesies? Yeah, I do. No. Like what you mean? What kind of, like, what kind of, what kind of onesies? Like, yeah, what kind of onesies? There's different like kinds the shorts, of onesies. The shorts, the whole baby bop shorts. I wear shorts, long. Yeah, no, onesies, girl. Hold on, do y'all do y'all wear the thong onesie? <laughs> now that's wild. That sounds like <laughs> a bikini. <laughs> what? I'm about a unitard. What the hell is that? Hold on, oh, y'all. So y'all unitar? saying y'all ain't never seen the the thong onesie with the? You mean like a body? Yeah. Dress? Oh, that, that's what he's talking about—a body suit. No, well, well, it's, it's, it's a it's a it's a, it's a, a top a, that a, turns a into a neck. thong. But then, and then they put us us fly net skirt over the bottom part. No, no, I'm not wearing that. No, no. That's, that's wild. No, I don't want to. I wear no. I wear all body suits. Yes. Yeah, I'm body suit girl. So are, we, are we talking? No are we talking? Got no hanging Hold on, I'm like, just, just trying to figure out why Ruth asked that, asked that question about the body suit. You talking? Right? I know. I'm still waiting on that too. And then Baby Bob used to wear that. And Bernie. What? I, I hate um, what? <laughs> I hate them. I hate them. Ruth, you, you got... Baby Bob wore that. I know you should Baby Bob wore that. Yeah, Baby Bob wore that. No. Ruth, you, you, wore yeah, Ruth, you wear no onesies? No. I don't wear no onesies. You don't wear them? Okay. So, are body suits modest, Ruth? No. I didn't think so. Cause I I seen some onesies. That's why I said what kind of onesies. Cause I, I mean, seen what, some onesies what is that the, what is ain't the modest at all. Well, just stop at the knees or the, the, the get away with it. But I mean, in general, no, don't stop at the knees. You told me to stop at the mid thigh. <laughs> but then I want to ask you higher than that. that. that we are talking about you talking about like out to a club or like to the gym? We're like there's higher than the no. Come on, you talking about like a cat suit, right? Yeah, they were everywhere. Like how to be dressing up for wing. Like Ronnie's from Players Club? No, the 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 really cotton. Like, I seen he a bunch the of these girls. No, she's talking yeah. about Friday. Uh, Friday no, at the I've next. Never, the girl that came I've in never with worn the a body suit to the club. Friday at the yeah, next. Yeah, I've never worn a body suit to the, the girl that came in with Pinky. Yeah. What, what was her name? Oh, Lollipop. Her 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 name is Lollipop. Awesome, <laughs> 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 Lollipop. What did she have? From the grocery store to the daycare. No. Wherever. She had a fucking fish no. on, bro. No, that's I will wear a suit to the no. gym. No. Yeah, not the thong one. <laughs> not the not the uh, leotard. I'm not going to, yeah, to the to daycare. That's what I mean, like, the Shakari Richardson. Yeah, Everybody yeah. have their own personal style. Like, you know, yeah. you do what you do. All I'm saying is, there's, 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 like, there's, there's a place for every, there's a, a yeah. time and a place to wear certain things. And there certain was a, certain bar, body types for certain things. I think there was this a school kinda, teacher who who wore a body suit. Guys agree but it went all the way down to her mid calf. You said, do the guys agree with mm. what Ruth in particular? With what Casey said uh, that there's a time and a place for certain outfits. Yeah, I don't think the guys of think it's a time and a place to say it's modest or not Jeez. modest. You see what I'm saying? Well, I mean, yeah, perfectly. I wouldn't wear a body suit to church. <laughs> the clothes, the clothes I wear to the gym oh, is not I'm the clothes that I would wear to pick up my kids from school, and the clothes I would wear to the gym is not the clothes that I would wear to a picnic with my in laws. Like I'm, I was raised that there's a time and a place to wear certain things, and that's where you wear it, and you don't pull it out for other things, and. Like my husband has never ever had to tell me how to dress to go any freaking where, and he loves the way I dress. So I like I don't think, you know different strokes for different folks. I don't think there's ever a place where a cat suit would be seen as anything other than fuckable. <laughs> like I don't think any, there's a one place that you would be able to wear a cat suit <laughs> and not be seen as 
Yeah, I'll just. I don't I, know. Like, I think what me and Brown agreed. Sugar are talking about are body suits, and you're talking about like stripper pet suits. <laughs> like, that's not that's well, not the. I'm same trying to think thing. what Ruth was talking about. She brought it up. That was, you was talking about like a cat suit where it's like skin tight type, or when you said when you said onesie. Oh, you mean the one with the shorts? I mean the body suits. It doesn't matter. Like it just anything that's like really tight on your. Everything's okay. Tight. So you meant the tight ones, like the the little got the well, white all of them are tight. But but all of them are tight. tight. It don't matter if it's shorts or if it's um to your ankles. You know what I mean? Um, yeah, it's a lot I of stuff. Modest- form fitting clothes. I would argue that uh, depending on how volu- not voluptuous, but how curvy or how 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 built she is could make it even more like for sure I, somebody would for argue sure, yeah. like if she if it's like, a girl that's like a size one with no lady eating loves up them shorts okay yeah, yeah so if a, woman, if a woman so showed up and like if she's small then it's okay to wear uh the bodysuit she is she ariana grande i mean i don't think nobody give a fuck but like if she's serena williams in a bodysuit or some shit like that like everybody gonna be like Sitting on stilettos or some shit like that. Now you see her calves and her quads and her ass cheek all rise up like a tide of water. Like you like what the? Because it's because it's a thing. It was a like, distraction. Because when we go to church, it's a whole nother thing. Like when you wear your dress and if you if you hear the pastor a whole nother, it doesn't, it doesn't matter. I'm not talking about the pastor's daughter. I'm just saying when you would just wear a dress. He started and you know you wearing some shit you ain't supposed. To. If he coming here like the j- 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 Jesus, he said, yeah, you said church. <laughs> <laughs> like, what are you talking about? Like if somebody showed up, what are like, we talking something? about? Like if somebody showed up in something that Simone Biles wears on the, like on the uh, on the balance beam. Are we? Cause I, I just thought about that. Like there is a space where they can wear body yeah, suits, and it's like gymnastics. And that's a like leotard. That. So right, if, yeah. said, if somebody like, like, oh no, man, leotard. I think a lot of women out here trying to turn leotards into club outfits, man. Yep. Y'all don't say yeah, that really. like y'all ain't saying it. I mean, there's actually, there's actually, uh, there's actually an Asian woman who's getting problems. And there's an Asian gymnast like it's right now. Yeah, no, they're saying it's too revealing. Did y'all see that? Because there's an Asian, there's an Asian woman, but she kind of stacked. And she wears pretty much the same office, but they're saying she's revealing too much. She's a gym. She was in the Olympics. There's an Asian woman that was in gymnastics, and her, you sure her that office was one that was Photoshop. No, no, no. I saw her. I saw her video. She was flipping, and yeah, she kind of stacked, bro. So <laughs> what I'm saying about is that because she definitely stacked. <clears throat> she Asian. She like blazing. No, she's from. Nah, you this, talking this, about this, from the US? I'm find her. Nah, she's not from U.S. This, I'm gonna I'm 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 get her name. I'm gonna get her name real quick. Give record, me a second. I never this. said bodysuit in church. I said I was trying to make a point that when you when you are in church, you can wear a dress and that will be appropriate for like the business world, but it'll be inappropriate in church. So it's kind of like uh, if you if you are showing your curves, it's inappropriate, and you like a sweater would be more like more modest. It's not to say that you're not modest, but even more, it's levels to modesty, is what I'm trying to say. So in some right. cases, you do have to wear that cardigan. All right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna bring up some body suits. How's this? I will wear that. She looks good. She's cute. That's appropriate. Wow. But I mean, depending on where she's going. Oh, that's a bad BBL, but I will wear that. Yeah, I have those. They all the same. Yeah, they yeah. all the same, bro. I will wear that. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I was bringing her, her name. Well, her name is Caitlyn Ohashi. It does on your body. Um, I have went to a water Kate, park one time. I went to a water park and I had on the two piece, and the director of the water park was like, "Ma'am, ma'am, this is a family park." And I'm thinking like I don't got on nothing <laughs> different, but yeah, I good. it was my butt and everything. And she was like, "This is a family park. Can you cover up, please?" Like literally asked me to do that, and I was like, "Is it the sw- the the, the two piece?" But it was too much butt. Probably Fred, saw you a happy, bro. Probably this woman is not spent. She probably saw a little bit of tag. <laughs> this and like, woman too. is like okay. Right, she's probably yeah, about the they don't have that This woman is not spent. All right, make sure be careful what. What you putting up, Sweeney? Oh no, it's it's her it's her uh, it's her um her uh actually performing in the Olympics. I ain't gonna, but no, she is not stacked now. What what is it? You is got, it, you got, you got it, her picture in your phone, bro? Right? No, I just looked up her name on Google. <laughs> Hold on. 
I think it just depends on what you've been exposed to and how you've been. So like, you better what, put what incognito you on your, on your bra before you look that shit up, bro. Tell Women can you. dress many different ways. Just like men dress many different ways. And there's men and women for everybody. This kind of goes back to the conversation that y'all had last week with the show I missed. I think it was on Sunday mm-hmm. where y'all were talking about how women um, dressed and or what they would do for how they would dress for their men and all of this type of stuff. That whole conversation. Mm-hmm. Um, men like different things. Women like different things. So... I don't. I don't think we on this panel of a few people could like put a stipulation on what people can and cannot wear. Mm-hmm. Jr. I'm putting in the back chat. The, um, it's a little video. You can review it first before you put it up. But what do you say, Bruce? It, I, I feel like it's a expression the of your of your husband. Right. Right. I agree. It depends on the I'm man. You can dress afraid. sexy with your man. And- <laughs> sometimes, I, I, sometimes I want my woman to. You know, when we go out, I want her to look like. Yes. Give amplify my status. Yes, and that's that's how that's how my husband is. And I'll be like, yeah, wear that. Hell yeah, she'd be like, yeah, you got shit. Like, put, yeah, wear that, put that shit. On. Put, that put, on. That on. put that on. Put that on. Yes. And when be like, you're not, well, I know you ain't let your woman walk out of the house like that. Yeah, but she got to walk back in. When I'm too. when I'm not when I'm not with my husband, my husband knows how I carry myself. It's still a level to class that I'm gonna have on whenever I leave the house. Period. That's why he was attracted to me. Whether I was single or married or in a relationship, I'm still going to carry myself in a manner that represents who I am and how I was raised. But I have a sex appeal about me. I was a professional dancer. I'm a been an athlete. Like that's that is what it is. But I'm still I still have some modesty to me. I've never worn Mm -hmm. a freak. I even wear a bait. I even I had never been on a beach for the longest because my mother didn't like wear swimsuits and stuff like that. Like there's, even though I was a dancer with hardly nothing on, I still didn't really own a pair of shorts. Like I, I, it was certain things. No, I'm from Louisiana. I'm from Baton Rouge. Really? Okay. Yeah. I was going to say, I was going to say, if you was from Chicago, yeah, you damn right. You ain't girl wearing no, uh, wearing no bathing suit on the beach. Just all t-shirts and uh, basketball shorts up there. Yeah, no, I mean, my mom just was very conservative, like extremely conservative, but she still allowed me to be expressive. And like y'all saying, like, she's very sexy, even though she's extremely conservative. And I'm just a, I'm just sexy in a different way. I'm not like wild with it, but I do embrace my womanhood. That's something that I, I, I love being a woman. Like, I love that. And I embrace it, but I always keep class about me, whether I'm in the gym or whatever I'm doing. I, I like, like to be like fly. That's I like what to be I was going to say, too. It's sometimes, I mean, you can put something on, but it's still how you carry yourself. Right. Yeah. So, right. like, if you if you go to the gym and you work hard on your body, man, just it, it's, it's one thing I believe in. If you if you actually put the work in, treat your body I and mean, treating your body is by, you know, expressing it. You know, this is the work I put in. Right. And and if that's what you did, like I tell my wife, all the gym, you go to the gym all the time. Yeah. Where where would you want to wear that amplifies the work you put in the gym? Right. You know what I'm saying the same as what a man do. If a man go in the gym and exactly. work on his chest and his biceps and shit, best believe he's going to wear a shirt that amplifies. He yeah. gonna wear the little the little skinny yep. tank top yep. where it's just yeah, covering gonna... his nipples <laughs> and all the middle of his the chest. Little, the little yeah, it only makes sense. Top. It all makes sense. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. He gonna That's have all say, his when shoulders. I do day, he gonna have his out. He gonna have his abs Meets popping out the sleep. side of the shirt. Like men do the exact same thing, and when mm-hmm. women feel good after they worked out, and especially especially if you go to a gym where it's other women that like are sexy, like it. It, it 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 pushes you to feel good about your body and your skin mm-hmm. because they're embracing themselves mm-hmm. and everybody's like, you know, everybody's cute and have their own style in the gym. It's I mean, it's a whole it's a different it's a vibe that you just feed off each other and everybody's working hard. It's just it is what it is. And then that bleeds into your regular life when you come home and go to work or whatever. You're not gonna just throw stuff on. Like I, my mom never left home without like lipstick and dress nice. She didn't go to the grocery store without being like in a full outfit. So I don't know what it's like to just be bummy and 
over like I love oversized clothes, but if I'm wearing something oversized, it's still gonna be fly. It's a look like it, yeah. It, it, so whether it's form fitting or oversized, like I did the whole Aaliyah look and the Tommy oversized Tommy O figure and Fubu in middle school, everything oversized and big and hanging off of you. I still like and put a lot of effort into those oversized clothes. You know what I'm saying? So I think it just depends on the person and how you carry yourself and like the class, as Sugar was saying, you still have to you still have to like wear it in a certain way and in a certain manner and to a certain place. 